Hello, I'm Mark Andraska from HHA Sports, and I'm going to show you how to assemble and install your lens kit and or also the sunshade onto your HHA optimizer bow sight. When you first get your uh, lens kit in the packaging, you're going to have a bag that's going to contain two little small 440 caps. They're going to be 440 by 316 caps, and you're going to need a 332nd Allen key in order to install this lens kit. You're also going to have an O-ring that's going to be inside of the retaining cap. You're going to take that O-ring out at the moment and the two pieces are actually spun together. You're going to need to back the one off that's got the knurling on it. You need to back that off probably about, oh, I'd say about a quarter of an inch or so should be fine. Um, and from there you're going to take your lens and your lens is going to go into your scope housing just like a, a, a pair of glasses. You're going to want the, the domed part to go away from you or closer to the target. So we're going to put it in just like so into the scope housing first. And then what goes next is the O-ring. And then our cap. And our cap has a little bit of a cutout on it. And the cutout on the, on the lens retaining cap is going to go onto the side where your micro drive is coming off either to the left or to the right depending on if you have a right hand model or a left hand model. So you're going to put those two together like so and then we're going to take our small 440 by 316 cap screws and we're going to install them into the top and bottom holes on your scope. And in order to do that we're going to need to be working over a table so we don't lose our stuff and just get them each started just that little bit. Don't tighten them down right away. And the main reason for that is you don't want to just crank them down right away so that you can actually tighten up the proper tightness on the, the retaining cap. Because you're going to want to spin that in now. We're going to spin that in because we backed it off about that quarter of an inch. We're going to spin that in, tighten that up to where we can start feeling that O-ring biting against everything. And then we're going to come back around and just tighten both of our cap screws up, get them nice and tight, and then come back around and just give it just that little bit of extra, and that should be completely installed and ready for you to shoot out in the woods. And that's just installing just a regular lens kit, okay? Now if we were to install the sunshade, the sunshade comes as an extra option if you want that. You will take what you have here, leave it as installed, and just spin out your retaining cap. Back that all the way out. It's a little more snug now and it should back out. If for some reason it doesn't spin out really easy and back out, you may want to just relieve the two cap screws, either top or bottom. Just kind of crack them loose a little bit and it'll make it a little easier also to actually thread the sunshade back in. Your o-ring is still left in there from before and just spin him Find the threads, spin him in there until it starts to engage against the O-ring, just like before. And then tighten up your screws. And then also give it that last little bit. And the sunshade is a nice little option for if you're out in very bright daylight hunting situations where you want more of a nice scope tunnel view and it helps block a little of that glare and whatnot. But it's a, it's a very nice option for your HHA optimizer bow sight. And that's the installation for a sunshade and lens kit onto your optimizer bow sight.